Hello, this is Lara with DSP Support. In this video, I will be going over how to send a robomailer. Email is the preferred method of communication for many studios. And with DSP's free robomailer, you can easily send an email message to one student or parent or the whole studio. There are many ways to send an email. The first option is from the main DSP screen, where you can click the Actions dropdown and select RoboMailer. Here, you can select groups or individual classes to email. The next option is from the Quick Links menu on the left of most screens within DSP. This will bring you to the same screen with the same options. To email specific students, click to the main student screen, check the students to email using the checkboxes or the options in the links here. Then, using the blue Student Actions dropdown, click the option for Send Email to Selected Students. This will allow you to send an email to those specific students. The same process can be repeated on the main classes page and on the parents page. Emails can also be sent to an individual student or parent by going into their account, locating the email address field, and clicking the envelope icon on the left of the email address. Emails can also be sent by clicking into a specific class, choosing the class actions dropdown, and selecting email class. When you design your robomailer, keep in mind that there is no limit in length. Files can be attached to your email, links can be inserted, and images can be added, and formatting can be adjusted to meet your needs. On top of all of these great features, you can schedule emails to go out at a specific time. To schedule an email, choose the recipients using one of the methods discussed in this video and prepare your email. Then click the Schedule Message button at the bottom to choose when you would like this email sent. Multiple emails can be scheduled at a time. If you send the same types of emails frequently, you can also set up message templates by clicking this hyperlink or by going to More, Settings, Communication Settings, and Add New Template. This makes sending certain emails out quicker and easier. Sometimes information requires a call. DSP's RoboDialer is here to help. RoboDials cost 10 cents per call and have a minimum charge of $1. So sending to large groups instead of a bunch of smaller ones can save you a good bit. There are a few ways to send a robocall. The first option is from the main DSP screen where you can click the Actions dropdown and select RoboDialer. Here, you can select who to call from groups or individual classes. The next option is from the Quick Links menu on the left of most screens within DSP. This will bring you to the same screen with the same options. RoboDials can also be made to an individual student or parent by going into their account, locate a phone field, and clicking the keypad icon to the left of the phone number. Many users choose to start their message by stating that it is from the studio, such as a message from the dance studio or something similar. We recommend typing directly into the voice message field and not copying and pasting from another source. You can test the call before you send it to make sure your message sounds the way you'd like by clicking the test button. The system will call your main phone number on file and you can listen to the call to hear exactly how it will be sent out. <music> 
sending a text message can be helpful to get information out quickly. Robotexts cost two cents per text message and have a minimum charge of one dollar. So sending to large groups instead of a bunch of smaller ones can save you a good bit. There are multiple ways to send a text message. The first option is from the main DSP screen where you can click the Actions dropdown and select Robotexter. Here, you can select who to text from groups or individual classes. The next option is from the Quick Links menu on the left of most screens within DSP. This will bring you to the same screen with the same options. To text specific students, click to the main student screen and check the students to send the text message to by using the check boxes or the option in the links here. Then, using the blue Student Actions dropdown, click the option for Robotext Selected Students. This will allow you to send a message to those specific students. The same process can be repeated on the main Classes page and Parents page. Text messages can also be sent to an individual student or parent by going into their account, locating the phone field, and clicking the icon on the right. As you compose your message, keep in mind that Robotexts do have a 160 character limit. Many users choose to start their text message stating that it is from the studio by adding texts such as from the dance studio or something similar. We recommend typing directly in the text message field and not copying and pasting from another source. We also recommend avoiding emojis and other special characters. As always, if you have any questions, please do not hesitate to reach out to us at DSP Support.